everyone, we are the Berry Girls, brought to you by Hen House Markets. And we've made it our life's goal to show you how to eat healthy and make, make it count. count. Welcome to the Berry Girls Kitchen. Today we're making it count by cooking up some delicious chicken burgers. Oh, there's so many benefits of eating chicken. It has a high content of vitamins such as A, E, and K, which contributes to red blood cell production. And that's important because the more red blood cells our body produces, the more oxygen will flow to the body's tissues, increasing its overall function. Here we have already rinsed the chicken tenders. We're going to place them on a baking sheet in a single layer and bake them in the oven we've preheated to 400 degrees for about 30 to 35 minutes. Once they are fully cooked, we'll take them out and let them cool. Now that our chicken tenders are cool, we're going to mince them. All right, so we've placed two or three pieces mm -hmm. of the cooked chicken tenders mm -hmm. in the food processor. And if you need to do smaller pieces, mm -hmm. that's fine too. Did you know that consuming chicken can also support good eye health. It's a powerhouse full of retinol, lycopene, alpha, and beta carotene. So if I eat enough, I could develop x-ray vision? I don't know about that, but you can tell your children that and we'll see if they go for it. Now let's make some chicken patties. We are going to add in our chopped spinach. We're also going to throw in some chopped onion, some minced garlic, and bell peppers as well. So let's go ahead and get that all in here. All right. How about we chop up a little more, Mom? You can never have enough spinach, correct? That is correct. Let's not forget our onion. Now, feel free to add in as much or, you know. As little as you want. Yeah. yeah. Just use your onion -o meter to gauge how much <laughs> onion -o -meter. you want. onion <laughs> But I suggest with a big batch like this, just throw it all in. How about okay. that? Sounds fantastic. And it gives so much color. Look at the color it gives. We're also gonna put in our minced garlic, all of it. Then we're gonna do our bell peppers. Now have fun with your bell peppers. You can use green, yellow, Some or red. There you go. Are you ready for these herbs? I am ready. Now, the recipe also calls for two brown eggs, okay? Now we're gonna whisk these together. Absolutely ectastic. We're going to put the egg inside of the mixture. We're going to add just a skosh of oil. And this oil helps with the binding of the patty? It does, along with the egg. And that's a trick that you actually taught me. And thank you very much for that. Well, you're welcome. That'll be a few dollars. <laughs> and lastly, we will add the Berry Girls Sweet Seasoning. Yummy. You can use um, another sweet seasoning that will have um, that type of yes. flavor profile. Yes. But in our Berry Girl seasoning, we yes. have honey, we have lime. Did you know honey powder is a super powder? I did not. A lot of people don't. But I should have known honey has so many great properties. It does, it does. It's a really good way to fight your allergies as well. Well, I think we're ready to make the patties. Make our patties. Now that we have our mixture together, let's drizzle a little bit of oil into the pan and get those patties formed. How about that? Let's make them. About a palm size portion. This is the fun part, guys. The kids are gonna love this part. So these will be cooked on each side for about four minutes. So watch them very, very, very closely. And like I said, if you feel like you wanna add in more seasonings, more this, more that, go right ahead, have fun with it, because no matter what, you're still making it count. That's correct. And you can see that they do get brown, so that, that's kind of your indicator, as well as the four minutes on each side. While mom is cooking the chicken burgers, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up some bok choy for our bun. This is just another way to make it count. Isn't it pretty? All right, that's your bun. Now, feel free to put your tomatoes, and then you're just gonna cover it however you like with your condiments, simple as that. Using bok choy instead of buns is just another way to lower your carb count and increase your protein. Your stomach will be pleased. Very pleased. Delish, there you have it. The Berry Girl's best chicken burgers. Like and follow Hen House on Facebook and YouTube for more delicious and nutritious recipes from the Berry Girls. And when you try these at home, leave us a comment and let us know how you make, make it, it count. count.
Come back for more nutritious and delicious recipes from the Berry Girls. The Berry Girls are brought to you by Hen House Markets. Berry Girls out.